Alright, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy X. I, uh, I have some bad news. I was recording this, and I recorded it. I had pretty funny commentary. I did the thing, and then unfortunately, I accidentally deleted my commentary. So I'm having to do this as post-commentary. So unfortunately, that's just kind of what happened. I, I guess when I was deleting older footage, I accidentally clicked on the commentary for this, and it went bye-bye. So yeah. Um, but in the last episode, I pointed out that I missed the Albed primer, so here it is. V goes to F. Pretty straightforward. Um, yeah, I kind of hate doing post-commentary. This is actually the first time, I can't believe it, but this is actually the first time I've had to do post-commentary, which is a little, a little shocking, but... I mean, I don't even remember what I was doing, honestly. It's It's been about a week since I recorded this episode, which that's also part of the reason this episode is getting delayed in its upload. It was originally supposed to be uploaded um, earlier today, because uh, today is the 5th of July. Um, but I discovered this issue last night when I was getting ready to edit it, and I didn't have enough time to do the post-commentary <laughs> last night, so I'm doing the post-commentary right now. The good news is, this episode isn't super long, so it should be really easy to do the post-commentary. shouldn't take hey, too long. Let's go. You're really famous. We don't get separated. Yuna! Huh? Hmm? What was that? <laughs> In Xanarkin, we do this to cheer on Blitz players. You try it too. Put your fingers in your mouth like this. Like uh-uh. Not like that. This. Then, you just blow. It's not working. Practice. Okay. Hey, use that if we get separate. Then, I'll come running, okay? <laughs> well, guess we should just stick together then. Until you can do it. Yes, sir. Uh, I kind of hate doing post commentary just because whenever I'm playing the game, I I have a lot more to say. Although, right now uh, I can tell you what we're doing. We're actually going to go pick up the next Albed Primer, and it's kind of in a weird spot. The area that we're going to is actually a place where we can view like older cutscenes from earlier, like FMVs. And on the floor of this area should be Albed Primer number seven. K goes to G. Oh, come on! <laughs> there we go. I'll bid Titman. Um, if I recall correctly, we were actually getting to the part where Yuna was about to be abducted, if I recall. So, anyway. Um, I was actually debating on speeding this video up a little bit, and I might still do it. I'm trying to decide. Uh, because at some point, I'm I'm probably going to stop post-commentating, and it's going to just have just the game by itself. But I wanted to at least give a little bit of something, so that way you guys understand what happened. Um, it it still kind of sucks that I did that. That was stupid. Anyway. Whoa. This is a so yesterday was the 4th town. of July, and that was kind of exciting. Um, unfortunately, I didn't actually here. really celebrate it. The most celebration I, I did is I you went know, for like a 5k run it. later in the evening, which uh, was really Towns tough, as it turns out. Um, doing a 5k whenever it's 92 degrees and humid in, in the because middle of Oklahoma of ain't together. easy. It was, uh, it was a very challenging so, thing. Hmm. Kind of gave me the feeling, what about I, I don't know why, it's but while here. I was running I had this like... 
it's not feeling that I was in like Red Dead Redemption 2 whenever it's just hot as nuts outside and uh, all you're wearing all of that gear to try to protect your like skin from sunburns and stuff like it's really the only I don't know for some reason it made me have. think of like how they would feel because I, I was sweating horribly during my run I also ran a horrible Whoa. pace it was like an 11 minute mile which is not pressure. very fast at all for a 5k but I'm much more of a distance <laughs> runner than a speed That's runner right. I, uh, I started really Is fast, like I started like at like a seven minute mile and I ran the first um, like mile and a quarter at that mm. pace. So I was doing well, really good, but buildings. then the place that I was All running had a lot of hills on it. Together. And those hills make it really, really challenging to do any kind of um, running. So, so unfortunately, that, that's a thing that happened. <laughs> Let's go find Sir Oren. So anyway, um, I haven't really talked about the episode all that much, but uh, last time we had heard that Oren was found in a cafe, and so we're just trying to find Oren. Um, and that's basically it, from what I remember anyway. Bunch of cutscenes are coming up. Oren's not here. Hmm. Like I said, not really much to say. It's it's hard to do post commentary. It's it's just really hard to do post commentary. Not see Yenke for ten years. Say something. Kimari forget Yenke? Forget Biran? Leave Kimari, Yankee. Kimari is small, Ranzo. Kimari so small, can't see Yankee and Biran's faces. <laughs> Kimari forget Ranzo, friends? We taught you much at time of Hornmut. Biran taught Kimari to be strong, Ronzo. Maybe talk too much. Take him on. <laughs> oh! Bring it outside. The tournament's starting. You hear? That's the game. Today on this glorious day. Players from all over Spira have assembled here to participate in this great contest of bravery, skill, and strength. All of these fine teams, equally renowned, deserve to win the cup today. Such is the nature of this contest. Let us, the spectators, play our role accordingly. Let us sing to the glory of the winners and applaud equally the valor of the defeated. Contestants, may heaven be with you.
Kamari, Yuna's gone. I'm pretty sure Titus had a voice crack there. Where in Spira have you been? Huh? Yuna's been kidnapped by the Al Bed Sykes. In exchange for her safe return, they want the Aurochs to lose. What? If they're only Blitzball players, I doubt they'd do anything drastic. But we shouldn't take chances. Let's go get her. I'm going too. This'll be no problem. They're telling the Aurochs to throw the game, as if they needed to. I mean, how good a team can they be? Waka said the same thing. He'll take care of the game. We should go get Yuna. The Albed boat is in Dock 4. Let's go. And so now we have to go rescue Yuna. Which is what I'm probably going to record either today or tomorrow. So anyway, just about at the end here. Um, yeah, I mean, I just, I just don't have much to say. Like I said earlier, I hate post commentary. <laughs> I just don't have anything to say. I, uh, I could have probably come up with something if I wanted to, but I just couldn't think of anything entertaining, other than my little spiel about Fourth of July, which was yesterday. Um, I guess I could say that the other part of that, the reason why I didn't really get to do much. Also, here's some chests that we're picking up. Um, I didn't really get to do much on the 4th of July because my parents and my girlfriend um, weren't able to come and visit me. My girlfriend could have, but she's actually about to come and see me again later, and it would have made more sense for her to just wait until she comes and sees me at, at the later time that she was going to see me than to come up for the 4th. Because um, it would have cost both of us a lot of money and a lot of gas to make that happen. So, Because she still lives an hour and a half away from me right now, so... It's going to be just better to wait, but unfortunately that meant that I did almost nothing yesterday, except I did finally get to watch uh, Avengers Infinity War, which I know I'm super late to the ball on that, but I did finally watch it, and uh, now I have to watch Endgame. Actually, no, I have to watch Ant-Man 2 and then Endgame. Which I believe that Ant the events of Ant-Man 2 happen during Infinity War? Or maybe just after? I, I, I really don't know. The people here are so into the game they don't even look at what they're buying. Hmm. <laughs> Gotta love Blitz, eh? Alright, well I think that this is just about the point where I had stopped recording because I, uh, I had things that I had to do. So, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy X where hopefully it's not post-commentary. Anyway, thank you guys so much and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. See you guys later.